is up, y'all. We are just ending up a beautiful night of fishing. Great night out here, incredible time. It's about to get dark, so uh, this video could apply, but uh, gotta get out of here for tonight. But basically, I wanted to show you guys the newest upgrades to the John Boat. I have got a new LED light bar right there. And I've got two in the back, one right there and one right there. Basically, these little lights make night fishing absolutely insane. And it's all running off of this one beautiful 12 volt battery, an interstate battery. So what I've done here is I've gone ahead and rigged up trolling motors so it's separate and the white here and then the red and black is for my switch panel. And then basically I've got the night lights going into the switch panel. So I don't remember which one it is. Oh, that's front, that's rear. Probably can't see the rear right now. Front, on, off. It's pretty neat. Uh, I'm gonna put in some footage now of us just out on the water having some fun. <laughs> It's kind of neat uh, having a John boat like this because you can customize it so much. But basically, I've got all of my wires coming off this battery. And then they run up one of the beams, because there's a beam going right through here and into the switch panel. And then everything inside that switch panel just gets to be an absolute jumbled mess. But that switch panel is key. The switch panel is huge because it can allow you to turn power on and off to all of my different things. I've shown you guys before some of the lights that I've got on here. I've got deck lights. I don't remember which switch that is. There it is. I've got deck lights. I've got some glow lights that are underneath here. You can kind of see a little bit. And then navigation, red and green. But I just wanted to show you guys a little bit, uh, you know, some things that you can do with the John boat. And one of the coolest things about that is that the wires go to the switch panel and then after the switch panel you have to run wires so it can be a little bit of a jumbled mess but i also do have some wires that come down here come across through here underneath and then run down the sides and what i've got here is just a little bit of tubing and inside that tubing runs all the wires they go through here up the seat you can see a little bit there underneath the seat and then in the back we've got these two neat little lights and believe it or not those two lights do just as good as the front light I like the back ones a little bit better because when you're driving it stirs up the water and the air and the water and everything just kind of glows it just makes it absolutely gorgeous but it's pretty neat so i hope you guys enjoy uh the little video i just kind of want to show you guys what you can do to the john boat i'm putting this video out there more for questions and uh comments if you guys want to see something special off this boat i can definitely do a video you know super customizable to you know how did you exactly wire it or um you know what else are you planning on adding stuff like that so let me know down below in the comments what you guys are thinking uh what you want to know this boat is so multi-purpose it's unbelievable trolling motor depth finder i've got a switch panel foot foot pedal for the trolling motor navigation lights regular lights i have brackets on here for a duck blind if you want to go duck hunting too i've got a duck blind that i custom made and did a little diy video on that I've got ram mounts on here for cameras it's it's just an all-around beast of a boat and i have caught insane fish off this this literally is a multi-purpose bass boat hunting boat uh, musky boat caught a lot of muskies off here some really really nice muskies but i uh, hope you guys enjoyed the little video and yeah and i'll make sure to leave the name brands of everything that i've got down below i mostly use nylight n-i-l-i-g-h-t brand stuff I think it's a cheaper brand, but it seems to be working pretty good so far. One thing you will want to notice is that LEDs typically reflect off the water rather than absorb into the water. So if you're trying to bow fish with them, they may not be the best option. But you might be able to see some fish, but again, uh, if you use more of a 
a yellow light it will absorb into the water so they are pretty neat lights they do pretty good um in the dark time in the dark i mean like you can see there it is they're super super bright so anyways thanks for watching guys hope you enjoyed the video and we will catch you on the next john boat adventure peace